what's up it's your girl Karina and you know what we're doing baby we're going thrifting I am here today at you know my faves like I feel like I don't even have to mention it because y'all know I'm obsessed with this thrift store but it's officially May and to me I'm like May is considered summer to me I wanted to thrift some summer 2023 fashion trends and to be honest y'all I haven't been keeping up with trends in general there's just so many different things that I've been really into but we can we also talk about the new aesthetic that we've been hearing everywhere on TikTok obviously you know Sophia Richie just popping off out of nowhere and being like I'm here baby but anyways I'm gonna grab my phone and maybe talk about some trends that I feel like we've been seeing the first one of course is like I feel like been a trend for a while maxi skirts and I think maxi skirts are just oh, such a good thing I love maxi skirts I've definitely became a maxi skirt girly i'm actually wearing one right now is like this raffia everything i don't know what that means but it looks like it's like those natural fiber purses and another thing is obviously like 90s minimalism style which i feel like i've been so adamant on it's just a very like basic dressing but it's just so chic and then if you pair it with the next trend that we've been seeing which is like the chunky earrings like i am so down with that i feel like if you've seen my last one from me i definitely thrifted a lot of like those chunky earrings and the next trend is like anything red which you know I've been obsessed with the color red for a cool minute so it's like a given uh, white trousers another way instead of wearing like heavy jeans these like white trousers are more loose and more fun wedges are definitely cute and modernized but I think for me I might leave the wedges behind but that's another shoe trend that we'll be seeing in the summer of course I feel like everything that we've been seeing is 3d florals so like I think flowers are just making a huge comeback the chokers like the florals on the clothing items so like y2k-esque so yes those are some of the trends i'm really excited to check them out and see if i can find them today at the thrift but before we get into thrifting i do want to thank today's sponsor which is skillshare skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for creators explore new skills deepening existing passions and get lost in creativity they offer classes on various topics like web development, creative writing, freelance entrepreneurship, marketing, and more. Skillshare has classes to fit your schedule and your skill level. Most classes are under 60 minutes with short lessons to fit any schedule. It's curated specifically for learning, meaning there are no ads and they're always launching new premium classes so you can stay focused and follow wherever your creativity takes you. The class I'm taking at the moment is 21 Days of Purposeful Productivity, Forming Habits for Long-Term Goals by Mike D. This has been insightful for me as a influencer creative who oftentimes feels overwhelmed with balancing time management. It has allowed me to learn how to make more time for the things that fulfill me. It's great if you're a beginner like me who's learning how to navigate the world of freelancing and productivity. I highly recommend it. Whether you're a dabbler or a pro, a hobbyist or a master, you're a creative. Discover what you can make with classes for every skill level. The first 1,000 of my subscribers to click the link in the description will get one month free trial of Skillshare so you can start exploring your creativity today. Don't forget to check out the links in my description box down below. Thank you so much Skillshare for sponsoring today's video and let's get back to the thrifting. beautiful white like strapless maxi and it's eyelet y'all i don't know what it is about old navy i've been finding old navy and they've been like killing it oh look i just found that striped pack set this is so pretty i love this oh my god if you had a summer wedding wow this mesh Oh, 
I just found this lace. So many maxi skirts. Look at this one. I think this is perfect. Example of the white maxi. This would be so nice for the summer. I found a denim maxi skirt, which I feel like is hard to find lately. That one's nice. Oh, this is so cute. I love the print. This is definitely very summer. So I've been having trouble filming my camera. I can't get it steady. So sorry if it's all iPhone camera right now, but I went through all the dresses and I found a couple, nothing being, I did find some soft linen, but right now I'm at the knits and I know like knits are in the summer, but like sometimes, you know, SoCal gets cold and I saw this one right here. I always wanted like a gradient one. It's only a dollar, so I think I'm gonna add that and I'm thinking I'm just gonna look right here at these, these sweaters. Oh, look at that. So like, even in the summer, I feel like this was some shorts, like a tube top. Cute. Oh my god. Okay, this is just like a unique find that I cannot, I, I have to take this. I cannot leave it. Cute. Oh my god, I've been looking for something like this for a while. Oh. Okay, so I'm looking at all the trends. I think we found maxi skirts. The bags I'm gonna look, let's look for 90s minimalism. And the color red. I think I did find a stuff that is red. 80s jewelry. I don't think I'm gonna find jewelry here per se, but the white trousers, that's what we're gonna check next and florals i did find a floral dress so okay let's check these tops y'all sorry it is like chaotic i think there's like workers everywhere because they're restocking um so it just hasn't been ideal with filming with my camera but i've been wanting like a zip up sweater i have a black one but i've been wanting like a white one and it has a hoodie so i have like no hoodies and then i found this one look at the swimsuits right now I, and i look you get a little nervous i just never want to get kicked out in these places so it's like you know but let's look at the bikini tops real quick For like a black bra bikini type of thing look at these these are so cute with like a white bikini top do y'all remember the brand roxy these are not roxy but this kind of gives me that vibe i'm gonna go to the short sleeve tops i think they're over here well let's just go ahead it's definitely that trend of red and it's silk okay i think a lot of the things i'm missing personally is a lot of summer tops so I think I will find some here. I'm telling you, Old Navy again. Like, look at this. I just found the other one. Another silhouette I've been liking is like this, where it's like very like ruffly mesh, a spaghetti style top. There's a little grommets on here. Just very fun top, but not necessary. See tops like these, so perfect for summer. Flowy, light. There's always an exception here where they have like new stuff with tags. So it's a little bit more pricier, but I think it's definitely worth the checking it out oh, I love the ruffles on this so pretty denim dress and it has pockets like oh this is fun it seems very summer I'm kind of interested in it look the sequins 
this with just like a little maxi skirt this is so cute right now This is so Betsy Johnson right now. Like, I have to take this. And it's my size, oh my God. This was meant to be, y'all. This is meant to be. Such a cute maxi. I'm so shocked I found that dress. I knew it was meant to come today. These were like some linen pants, which I need to go and check after this. But I also want to add that I feel like a lot of these trends like obviously a lot of them you can thrift them like that's a given that's why i do these videos but i feel like they're all in vintage inspired like they're all inspired by just like 60s y2k and so that's why i'm like a lot of these trends you can definitely find at the thrift because they've been trendy before so blatantly obvious but i just feel like it's becoming more obvious lately and i feel like there hasn't been anything new and innovative for a while so I'm in the long sleeve like button up so I feel like I should be able to find a linen button up here Ooh, this is giving me ballet tan. just the back I came today with like low expectations <laughs> yeah I'm probably not gonna find anything and lo and behold I have a full cart yeah I like the flowiness of this one. I would have taken these in a heartbeat because I would definitely want to take top classes again. I am at the pants looking for linen pants and these were the first ones I pulled out. Look at these cargoes I just they're the ones that turn into shorts. Okay, another thing we've been seeing is camo. Look, camo pants. Love these like slinky pants. These are so nice. I want some in like a black or like a black like, flowy linen style. I never stayed and look at the the pants, so this is new to me. I'm in the men's section and I'm about to look for a linen blouse. I feel like maybe there's not a linen long sleeve, but maybe a short sleeve. So for some reason, it's hard to find full linen. I just find like half lifting linen. Like this one's 55% linen. So I'm like, is that still going to be hot, you know? But I kind of want to try it out. We're at the part where I'm going to show you everything I found and it's a lot y'all. I honestly don't know how I'm going to condense it. This top, I really like this. I just feel like this with like some beautiful earrings, even like the ones I'm wearing right now in a maxi skirt would be so cute. So I'm thinking for sure this one. These pants, I just grabbed them by accident. So we have this like crocheted top. I, I feel like I have something at home like this, but very summer, I feel like something that you would thrift this summer. Feel like i need something like this in my closet i don't have anything like this and usually day to day i go for stuff like this so i think this one i'm gonna take in for a dollar yeah have this bathing suit like one piece this is giving old money like sophia richie on her vacay her honeymoon like not my size but i just had to show you this i did find two linen pants so i found these ones and they're not 100% linen, but they're like 55% linen. And these ones, but these are more like wide legs, so I don't know how I feel about that. I found this linen top, and I just think it'd be perfect in the summer with the trousers just tucking it in. This top, I thought it'd be fun for like the ballet core, but honestly, I don't need it. This one, y'all know I'm taking, like, I cannot leave it. I don't know why I found like so many colorful sweaters but this one i just i don't know i think it's fun so pretty they're like perfect flowy like linen style tops with like a maxi skirt they're an extra large but they look small they're like vintage old navy which i feel like old navy that i've been finding has really great stuff so i'm gonna leave these two but this is another one i just have to take i really like this gradient sweater 
I don't know why I've got some knits, but I feel like this in the summer too, just like over a bikini at the beach, like a maxi dress and it's linen, so that's why too. It's like 100%, no, 55% linen. But just like throwing this on and it's hot, like the perfect dresses for that. So I've been wanting to find like silk style dresses and I think I found one. And this one also intrigues me. And we just have another like white eyelet mini dress, but I think we that one. Striped pajamas, y'all. This red color, I love. I'm obsessed. And they're J. They're J. Crew. They're J. Crew, y'all. Skirts I found. I found this one. It's like a nice Plaisley print, but it's also silk, which I love. I think I like this one better because it's like ruffly. It's silk. And I've been looking for a polka dot dress, but I think I might leave this one. Oh, this blue one is so cute, but I don't think it's my size. It's like a crochet cover-up, which I think would be perfect for the beach. I'm going to wrap everything up, and I'll see you at home. I'm so excited for today's thrift trip. Cuties, we are now home, and I have a haul for y'all. So I just have to get in here and show you everything that I found. And let's get to it, baby. When I upload this video, y'all, because I took a picture of this a massive sale they're going to be having. You're in the area... Go to Quality Thrift on Sunday, May 7th. They're gonna have everything like under $2. And first of all, they never open on a Sunday. So when this video's live, because you know I upload on Sundays, y'all need to go. So I'll, I'm probably gonna be there. So if you see me, say hi. This is like weird talking in the future. But get your little booty over there if you wanna hit a huge ass sale. This is one of the items where I'm like, this isn't summer, bitch. Have you seen today's weather? Maybe it's not summer related, but I feel like it's very spring and also can transition from summer to fall. This Eddie Bauer freaking cardigan. And I've been really liking cardigans just layered over baby tees. And I can imagine this with like maybe a strapless top, uh, shorts, and like those knee high boots or like campus fry boots. It's also giving something that you would find like on Anthropology or J. Crew so beautiful and lovely and this is actually by eddie bauer and it is wool so it's probably not the best practical but i've dealt with some wool and this one isn't that bad i think the outside's a little bit more itchy but it's definitely doable i know there was like this whole aesthetic of like house cowgirl or house girl like very horse girl or something like that y'all i'm bad with aesthetics but it's also giving me that vibe and this one was three dollars and 93 cents like you can't beat that because i feel like in other thrift stores they see the brand they see the style and they're like yeah we're gonna profit it up and they're like no this is a jacket like three dollars and 93 cents i really love about that thrift store it's just that they're not gonna inflate the prices because of what it is i think the only time they do that it's like with like leather jackets or the new with tag items they put in a little bit pricier because it's like new with tags but other than that like pretty solid we're in the topics of sweaters and i know and this is a summer thrift haul i just have to show you this one because this is another thing that i decided to get i was contemplating because i really like this one and that striped one that i found when i put it on with what i was wearing today i was like this is a freaking look but i decided to leave it because as much as I do like color and like to wear color, it hasn't been really like a statement thing that I've been working with. And so I just feel like this one is something I'm gonna be like grabbing towards easier. But it's just this like white zip up hoodie. And like I said, I feel like these are just so easy, especially for me, like, you know, in the summer and the spring, I'll go to Disney and it's like really hot during the day, but then it gets cold and these just are so convenient or even bowl. So it's like one of those necessities that I needed and I only really don't have any zip ups. All I have is like crew necks or even like stuff with hoodies. And when it, I don't know where it tends to rain, I'm like, oh my gosh, I don't have any hoodies. And it's by this brand called Style & Co, which I love finding at the thrift. And it was only a dollar and 91 cents. Yeah. Yeah, I really want to have like a capsule timeless wardrobe that I can just add like statement pieces on top of that but I already have like my my solid like wardrobe and I've been building that for a while now because I first kind of started thrifting I was thrifting more like first of all in my size because we all know that thrifting as a plus size person is a completely different experience so on top of that just finding things in my size but then i was trying to find a lot more like trendy trendy pieces and i was kind of dressing really trendy which i mean th don't get me wrong i probably still do but i feel like i've now figured out more of the items that i want and then like how i can keep like this seamless uh capsule wardrobe 
uh, style, but I can add like these fun statement pieces because I feel like that is definitely now my core style. Like that. My obsession with maxi skirts and just skirts in general has been like up here. I, I never really appreciated like the maxi skirts. As y'all know, I was a mini skirt girly, but something about a maxi is just so comforting and I love the flow of it. I easily dress it up or dress it down. And so when I saw this, this beautiful skirt, I just had to take it. First of all, I love the contrast stitching. I think that's really fun and I feel like it really adds a different like element to the skirt. At the bottom, it does have like these double hems. The material of this, it's so perfect for the summer. It's lightweight. I think it's silk. It feels like silk. Let me check. Yeah, it's 100% silk. Kind of the like one of the materials I've been really looking into is trying to thrift like 100% silk skirts or 100% linen. And I've come to realize a lot of the times those are really hard to find. So I'm really happy that I was able to find this. I feel like this would be perfect as a little like strapless dress you know i would do that as well and i just love that versatility and this one was only one dollar and 91 cents and it is by the brand called ie which i've never heard that brand before and it's an extra large y'all know in the thrift of me when i saw this i gasped and i just knew i had to take it and it was something that uh, totally reminded me of a betsy johnson dress those are hard to find y'all i've been trying to find a betsy johnson like you know, those summer dresses, those few fruit dresses. And I found this one. It is this cherry print dress. And the silhouette of this is giving me so much realization par. Which, you know, I've been talking about realization par dresses for a while. The polka dot dress that I've been talking about, it's available in the international like website, not the US website. And I was like, any of my international homies wanna like get it shipped to their house and then like I pick it up or something. <laughs> I really want that dress. But anyway, first of all, I love the silhouette. This is like the silhouette of dresses I really enjoy. Reprint, come on, that's totally summer. Some little slides or little pointed kitten heels. So pretty. Or even like red ballet flats. I think that would be cute. And this is actually by this brand called Pinup Cultures. So if you one of you want to search that up, I always search stuff like that up. So and look, it came new with tags, so here it is. This one was the most expensive one, but I was like $12 for this gorgeous dress. I'm taking it, okay? I cannot wait to wear this. That was everything that I thrifted. Such a fun, like, summer thrift with me. Like, just the beginning of summer, obviously, because it's still technically spring, but I'm always like, let's thrift a season ahead. Hey, I feel like it was a good way to start for thrifting in the summer. Anyways, y'all, that is all for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed this. We are gonna continue going thrifting because I have been in a very thrifty mood, so don't be surprised if you've been seeing thrift haul videos back to back. Girl is in that mojo, and I feel like when you have those feelings, like you just need to go. I feel like that's when the thrift gods are telling you, like, girl, I'm manifesting for you, you need to go. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I've had such an amazing day, and I'm so glad we got to spend it together. Together, and I'm so glad you took the time to watch me and my videos appreciate it very much and if you want to follow me on other social media platforms I'm living as Karina on IG and TikTok and you can also check my Pinterest to see what I've been pinning lately I have officially started my some summer Pinterest board so you can check that out if you are new to the channel please don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below it truly means so much to me and that is all loves I love you lots and I'll see you soon with a new video Bye.